official blew his whistle because he saw a foul that didn't exist. Terrible call. Huey gets called for a fourth. Willard will get two free throws. Huey leads. Huey has 12 points, but Michelle Briggs leads with 13. Free throw is good by Willard. Two-point lead for Monmouth. Big game for the Pioneers. They need a win here tonight against the Bonning Scots to break this log jam. Three-way tie for third place. Top four teams get to the conference tournament. Second free throw good by Willard. 53-50. Monmouth by three, six minutes to go. Grinnell beat this team in Monmouth, 63-57. Coleman on the near wing, way out. Coleman, way up top to Briggs. Briggs, far wing to Jennings. And a man for Monmouth. Jennings, fake, looks to drive, cut off. Jennings, looks inside, can't find the group. Jennings. Timeout call by Grinnell. 5.40 to go second half, 53-50. Monmouth on top. Tight ball game in game one of our doubleheader here at Darby Gymnasium on a Wednesday night. On a chilly night in Grinnell, Iowa. Chris Vaughn along with you, Richard Ballou, our producer. 53-50. Monmouth on top, 5.40 to go here in the second half. Grinnell has the basketball. The group looks to get it inbounds and throw it away. Looking for Briggs. And another turnover for the Pioneers. Up to 23 now, I believe. I've lost count. 23, 24, doesn't matter. It's way too many. Grinnell tells by three. On the near wing is Howard. Howard picks up her dribble. She's guarded closely. Got it to Williams. Williams comes back to the near wing. Way up top to Howard. Howard. Tries to back off a little bit. Far corner. Howard goes far wing over to Jones. Jones with eight to shoot. Jones with the drive. Jones near wing. Down near corner. Williams underneath. Shot up with two on the shot clock is good. How they let Williams drive on the baseline, I'll never know. But Grinnell suddenly trailing by five with five minutes to go. 55-50. Jenin in the far wing. Far corner to Clark. Clark. Can't go baseline, and Jones ties her up, and the arrow goes to Monmouth. Another turnover for Grinnell. Wow. As the offense just cannot get it going here. The Scots, ever since they went to this pressure tight defense, they stepped up their in defensive intensity about midway through the first half. Nord goes far away to Corbin, up top to Williams. Williams trying to get away from Briggs. Slide step, shot up in the lane, good. Oh, she schooled Briggs there. And the Scots now up to a seven point lead with four and a half to go. 57 to 50. Near wing is Clark. Clark up top to DeGroote. Open for three. No good. Briggs can't control the rebound. Falling down inside was Jones, but Jones has it on the front court. Jones goes inside. Williams shot up the glass. No good. Tipped around. Williams threw it back over her head. She walked. She was falling backwards. Threw it back. It didn't matter. It's gonna be, it was going to be Grinnell ball anyway because Williams either traveled or threw it away. I think she said she was pushed. This is a big possession for Grinnell. 4-10 to go. 18 fouls on Monmouth. 15 fouls on Grinnell. Grinnell is Two timeouts left to four for the fighting Scots. Full court pressure now for the Scots. Jennings in the backcourt. Jennings calls for Coleman. Near side in the backcourt. Coleman with the dribble. Crosses the timeline. Here comes the double team. Squeeze to the Jennings. Jennings will dribble to the far side. Jennings guarded by Corbin. Jennings looks inside. Picks up her dribble. Corbin out on her. And a timeout or a foul call. Foul call on Corbin. Wow. Going to be one and one for Ashley Jennings. Kind of a dicky tack foul, but Grinnell will take it. But Jennings has to convert the free throws. She's going to make the first to get the second. She's all one tonight. 60% from the line. And rattled it home. Boy, Nord, Paige Nord for Mama nearly fell into the lane. I think she got a false start 
from Jen, and Jen will try and get the second one here. And it's off the mark, no good, and the rebound comes to Willard. 57-51, a six-point lead for the Scots. Jones beats the pressure. Jones back pedals, gets it to Corbin. Corbin on the free throw line. Coleman somehow was able to deflect that shot. It comes to Nord. Nord, uh-oh, for three is Jones. It bounces straight up in the air, no good. Huey, the good block out on Willard. Huey, double team on the backcourt. Got it headed to Groot. To Groot, long pass to Clark. Clark backs it out to Jennett. It wasn't pretty, but it worked. Beat the pressure. Bounce pass to Huey at the elbow. Double team. Lobs it far wing. Jennett open for three. Rainbow pot of gold. Big three branch.